finders are reptiles, and their favorite food are mouse. And he's eating a mouse, really. Yeah, and they're venomous. Where in the where in the world do sidewinders live? Sidewinders mostly live in in deserts. Mostly live Arizona and Mexico. In the southwest United the, States. And the southwest. This is a sidewinder eating a mouse. You can you can see him moving under the rock. He's um he. He hasn't quite got the whole mouse in his in his mouth, but he's really trying to eat it. It's one of their favorite dinners. The video is it's a fast uh huh. It's kind of fast speed is kind of like fast forward. And he has a rattle, but his End of the tail is under the rock, so you can't quite see it. And there's and there's a human monster by by him. This side why sidewinders live in the desert and. There's another human monster. There Where was, was this sidewinder living? Uh, this sidewinder is living at a a a, a, a zoo uh, at the reptile house. So he has to be protected. So they put a little glass tank around him while he's with. The Heal monsters. How do sidewinders move? They they move sideways, kind of like that when he's moving. He they move like that when, if you can see him moving in this. Is that where they get their names? Uh yeah. This that's where they get their names, and he also is. We might see a rattle. While he moves like this, or may not. <laughs> and they, and he's still eating the mouse, and his, and he just needs to get the tail in his mouth, and then I don't think he'll eat for a few days because he, because he must be full. Is that pretty typical for snakes? Uh huh. Must. And it was a pretty big lunch, too. So, how come they only eat every few days? Uh, because after they eat their big yum yum yum, they're too full to eat anymore for a few days. Mm -hmm. And then, once, once they're hungry again, they just find something to eat. Okay, and also... When, and also, when you hear the rattle of a rattlesnake, make sure you look down and don't, and get away from it. Can they hurt people? Mm -hmm. Sometimes, if you step on them or something, or mm. touch them maybe. How would you know if you came across a rattlesnake? Uh, it would definitely rattle if you were almost about to step on it. To tell, to tell, I'm poison, don't step on me. Is that what the rattle says? Uh-huh. What should you do if you see a rattlesnake? Uh, maybe just go away from it. Hmm. You should back away from it? Uh huh. Should you try to pick it up? No. Why not? Because they're poisonous. Oh, and it might hurt you. Uh huh. What else would you like to tell us about sidewinder rattlesnakes? Side. Side.
sidewinders are a kind of rattlesnake. How big are sidewinders? They're two or three feet. Tell us about baby sidewinders. Baby sidewinders, I, I just watched a show about baby sidewinders and the full shoot. Are they so, born in eggs? No, they're not born, and they're not born in eggs. They're live born. How not, many are born in a litter? How many are born from the mom? Like ten. So she has a lot of mouths to feed. Do they live together? Uh-huh. I bet so. For about a week. Oh. Um, and they live together for about a week. And after a week, the babies slither off somewhere else by themselves. Hunting for food. Do you know what kind of food baby sidewinders eat? What? They like to eat lizards, little lizards. Oh. Tiny baby lizards like them. I bet tiny baby lizards like them. And sometimes they use their tail as a lure to try and help catch the baby lizards. Come to kadozy.com for more fun.